modern India is a great mix of uh, tradition and modernity. You know, we've come a long way from old times. The West might still perceive us uh, as a country of snake charmers or sages or mountains or, you know, peace, tranquility and all that. All that is there. I mean, that's not going to go anywhere because that's our core value. But India has progressed tremendously on the fronts of education. Uh, we are leaders in technology today. Our institutions of technology are among the top in the world. People want to come and study here. Indians uh, are IT leaders of the world. Uh, Silicon Valley, everybody knows, is powered by Indian people. You know, half of the people are, engi are Indian engineers working there. And then uh, topmost industrialists of the world, Lakshmi Mittal, he's among the richest people in the world. He's an Indian. I mean, so, you know, India is about, uh, India has moved on to become a new country. It has new knowledge. You know, it has developed tremendously well in a very short span. It has taught world how to manage economies. In the global recession, we were the only country whose financial systems were in place because, you know, uh, we believe in not so much of an open economy. Our banks were restricted. Our uh, most of our systems are nationalized. So we were able to, you know, save for the rainy day. So that's what we can teach the world and Denmark.